All right, you notice the floor in here, this concrete floor, is cracking kind of like a, uh, a, like spokes right into the center of this floor. And this definitely had a grade issue. If we look out the window, you'll notice there used to be a big embankment down here, but uh, we got these guys doing a whole bunch of hard work today. But as we come out, I'm gonna show you something interesting. You hear us talk about negative grade, poor grade, and all that stuff. So this embankment coming down here was definitely a source of moisture on the other side of this house. But it isn't always surface water flowing toward a house. And one of the things you're going to see right now, and I don't know if you'll be able to notice it, once we dug down over here, you're going to see that this is an area right here. We were watching water trickle in right here. This is groundwater, and this is different. When you have embankments like this, a lot of times you end up with water table and groundwater issues. Water actually finds ways of getting through the soil that creates veins that actually work their way towards houses. And that's how sometimes you'll hear people say they have water coming up through their basements. We've done several jobs where we were excavating and there were houses. We had one in Binghamton, New York, where there was water flowing through the basement for over 30 years. And they literally just created like a little river through their basement. And with a mini excavator, we were able to take two swipes across the soil and we dug right through you know, the subsurface water that was flowing into that basement and it stopped it in two seconds. And that's exactly the condition that we had here, which is you're gonna notice this is super wet and there's water trickling right out of here. So when I talk about grade issues and drainage, it isn't always a grade problem. Sometimes there are water table, groundwater, other types of water pressure, you know, uh, hydrostatic pressures and different things happening that Sometimes you have to bring in a geotechnical engineer to figure some of that stuff out and sometimes just good uh, Grading contractors like we have here today These guys are really good at figuring this stuff out too as to where the the water is coming from and how to remediate it So they're gonna end up putting in a French drain system here and uh, we're gonna solve this water problem